Okay, here. So here's a test setup that I've made for the uh, oil bypass valve in a LY7 3.6 liter General Motors V6. It's the one in my Cadillac SRX. This valve is actually removable. It's in the uh, end cap for the oil filter. You can see uh, this cap right here, and you just pull it out with a pair of vice grips. What I've done is I've gone in and made a fixture for testing at the uh, pressure at which it uh, opens and what I've done is I've got my uh, leak down tester and then I've uh, found that the valve itself will fit into a three-quarter inch coupler and then I've put in uh, the various fittings to get it to fit into the uh, leak down tester and so you can see I've got shop air uh, hooked up to it um, the uh, regulator valve is closed and as I open it and introduce air into the system, if you listen carefully, you can hear at about 10 PSI that it's actually leaking from the end of the valve. Hear that change? Now this valve is supposed to uh, remain closed until 21 PSI. So if you look at it, in this fashion and continue to open it up you can see that you can run as much shop air as, as you want yeah sorry about the compressor and we're still getting we're getting 21 psi so it it is opening roughly at the right pressure the max pressure but the min pressure the minimum pressure is still as i say uh, a little low so I'm wondering if I wasn't getting some uh, bypass when I didn't want any over the life of this engine. This engine had 167,000 uh, miles on it when it required a timing chain replacement for a startup rattle that it had for probably 15 to 20,000 miles, and uh, definitely there was uh, definitely there was some timing chain uh, noise. So anyway, I hope you find this helpful.